Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you how to get multiple modded checkerboard outfits. Make sure you watch till the end to see how you can wear them in free mode. So as you guys might know, checkerboard outfits are blacklisted for some reason, that means that if you equip an outfit with a checkerboard clothing item, it will disappear after a couple seconds. This is only the case in free mode, so you can still wear these outfits in missions in a heist for example. So at the end of the video I will show you a trick how to wear them in free mode too. But before we begin, check out Zebby Mods. They provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boost for all platforms. They are fast, cheap and reliable. Their accounts come with a lot of banked cash so check them out and use my code Mr. Lawrence at checkout for a 10% discount. The link will be in the description below and let's get straight into the video. With this glitch you will lose all of your saved outfits except for one. So equip one outfit that you want to keep and delete all your saved outfits. Now open your pause menu, go to online and swap character. Your main character on the left side has to be a male character and your second character on the right has to be a female, otherwise it won't work. If you haven't already, create a new second female character and copy the rank from your main character. Then just load into online and make your way over to any clothing store. If they don't appear, find a new session and they will appear. I already made all the component outfits and we will start with the first checker outfit from the thumbnail. First go to the accessories and make sure that your character isn't wearing any accessories like earrings. Then go to necklaces and purchase number 11. Now go to gloves and equip the light woodland armor. Then go to the glasses, casual glasses and purchase the copper marbles. These are for the checkerboard glasses. Now go to the hats. Then to canvas hats and purchase the second to last one. This is for the checkerboard hat. Now go to the top section, go to bus tiers and purchase the camo bus tier. Head over to the pants, then to jeans and purchase the black cropped, number 38. Now make your way over to the shoe section. Go to boots and purchase the ash winter boots, number 61. Now save this outfit in your second outfit slot. For the second checkerboard outfit we will only have to change the top, so go to the tops. Then to off shoulder tops and purchase the salmon striped top, number 54. Your outfit should look like this and now save this in your third outfit slot. All these outfits are pretty much the same, so we will mostly just change the top. Now scroll down to sport jackets and purchase the sea green puffer jacket, number 73. Stay in the tops and go to bus tiers. Now purchase the teal lace bus tier. Back out, open your interaction menu, go to style, accessories, chains and equip the Mai Mai black heart necklace. Save this outfit is slot number 4. Now we will make the third checker outfit, come over to the tops. Then go to sport tops and purchase the grey racer bag, number 50. Save this outfit is slot number 5. Then go to the tops, scroll down to work jackets and purchase the peach camo closed field, number 38. Stay in the tops, scroll down to gun running t-shirts and purchase the last one, the blue digital t-shirt. For the last black checkerboard outfit, you can just equip your Invis checker 1 outfit and go to the shoes. Now go to the high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat boots, number 24. Save this outfit is slot number 7. Now for the last outfit, go to the tops once again. 
Now equip the sea green puffer sport jacket again. Then go to Bastiers inside the tops and equip the white lace Bastier. Save this outfit in slot number 8. So your outfits should now look like this. Now open your interaction menu and take the easy way out. This way the game will quick save, when you respawn, open your pause menu, go to online and start creator. Once you are in creator, create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. Now open your pause menu again, go to online and choose character. Now you will need to delete your second character, so your female character. Then press circle or B to go back to story mode and when you are in story mode go straight back to online. Now when you are back in online you will still have the outfit that you wanted to keep. So just save this outfit in slot number 20. If you did everything correctly the other outfits are also transferred over. Now go to the biker suits. Then equip the black biker suit. These are for the gloves, so if you want different gloves on your checkerboard outfit, you can equip a different biker suit. Now we will need to do the clothing merge to make all these modded outfits. First you will need to bookmark the job from the pinned comment. While you bookmark the job, you will need to restart your game so it pops up in game. If you can't bookmark it for some reason, your friend can bookmark it and invite you to the job. Just make sure that the host changes the clothing setting to player saved outfits. And from here you can start the job. When you are on this screen, just press right on the d-pad once and ready up. Now make your way over to your apartment. You cannot see it on the map, but you should know where it's at. Now just enter your apartment, and if it doesn't let you in, blow yourself up on the blue circle and when you respawn, you can enter. Now make your way over to your wardrobe. You will now need to delete the checker polo outfit and save this outfit in slot 19. Then quit the mission through your phone. When you are back in online, you won't have your outfit yet, but now you can just equip it through your interaction menu. You can now go straight back into the clothing merge job unless you want different racing gloves. Change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right and ready up. Now go to your apartment. Delete the white checker component outfits and save this outfit in slot 18. Then quit the mission through your phone. You will now have these two outfits. From here, you can go into the job again, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right again and ready up. Now go to your apartment. Delete the invis checker outfits and save this outfit in slot 17. Then leave the mission. Go into the job one last time, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right and ready up. Make your way over to your apartment. Delete the black checker component outfits and save this outfit in slot 16. Now you will have all the checkerboard modded outfits. Now I will show you the new trick to wear these checkerboard outfits in free mode. First you will need to own a Kosatka. Then register as a CEO and go to the scuba gear. It will show up on your minimap. 
Now equip one of the checkerboard outfits and spam right on the D-pad to equip the scuba outfit. Now open your interaction menu, go to CEO, Management, Style and equip a CEO outfit. Back out and press right on the D-pad one more time. If you did it correct, you can now wear your checkerboard outfit without it disappearing. Unfortunately, if you close your game, quit your CEO or find a new session, you will have to redo that little trick. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will catch you all in the next one. Bye bye!